Good morning, friends. Uh, welcome to my channel, Textile for Everyone. Friends, in our last episodes, we have discussed about the dresses required for children, for the elder ones. In the same way, today, we will discuss about the a particular dress which you will find in any man's wardrobe that is a coat or suits and as you have seen that they are purchased less than formals and casuals but whenever there is marriage or you are going in your office meeting or attending seminars then they reflect your personality now today we will discuss about the characteristics of a good coat how to take care of your this dress which is lying in your wardrobe and another point is that what special precaution you must take while going for stitching or purchasing it ready made now as you have seen that the coat is purchased for comfort for service for better appearance but at the same time certain characteristics are induced by special finishes that is water repellent dust free shrink free shrink proof etc whenever you go to, to the market then you will find that there is wide variation in the prices friends if you want value for your hard earned money then make a principle of comparing garments at different price range the reason is that good quality fabrics they are color fast and pre-shrink and normally if you study it finally then first is the fabric is cut accurately the patterns they are matched perfectly the hand tailoring is skillfully done stitching is close and the collars are neat now characteristics if we found the want to study the characteristic of a good coat then you will find that if it is lining or checks then in high grade suit they are perfectly matched cloth is cut so that the pattern matches the way of lining is smooth and firmly stitched the shoulders are natural looking padded with light cloth and soft fabric 
And if you crush the leper, if you crush the leper, then it will come back to its original position within no time. Friend, which color you should wear? It has already discussed in my last episode. But the few things are necessary for caring of your suits. The first important part is that wherever you are putting this, your dresses, it must be air, airy, it must be dust free. And most important part is the light should be proper so that the insects may not damage these kind of things. Suits are all one when you are using your coat for office purpose or others, then they are hanged properly on hangers. They are not hand washed, they are always dry clean. And most important part is, as we have already discussed, that the suits they are classified accordingly, that is one for summer and other is for winter. The winter suits are woolen or worsted. And they are very heavy. So the polyester wool, terry wool, is the substitute of this woolen, 100% woolen garments. And the terry wool, if you observe, the basic problem with the woolen suits are that the pill, pilling formation is there. So you have, we have to take precaution in that. But when we talk about the summer, that is the cotton, linen, which are viscose suits or the coats, then again they need hand washing, not hand washing, but the uh, dry cleaning is required in that. And another important point is that they must be water repellent and the dust having dust free finish. So friends, this is all for today. I hope that you will like this lecture. And as we have told you that suits and coats they are the costlier garments for every man and it is one of the important garments in the wardrobe. So just by having proper selection of the fabric, just by going through the linings, the stitching, the design factors, we can save ourselves from paying extra. Thank you friends. Have a nice day.